As an extra lure this week, we're going to make another golden shiner, but out of this crankbait. Hmm. Let's get to work. To start this lure off, we're going to tape off the bill and put on a layer of Createx Opaque White. I put about six drops of Opaque White into the airbrush, and I think that's enough to cover up the whole entire lure. Next, I'm going to use a mesh to create a scaling effect. Since this is a smooth lure, fine mesh will create a nice detailed pattern. I fold the mesh over the lure and use alligator clips to hold it together where I can. The goal here is to try to keep the mesh as tight as possible to the lure shape. I'm then going to spray Createx Pearl Copper about three quarters of the way down the lure. I try to apply the copper in light layers so it doesn't get underneath the mesh. I then use Golden's Shading Gray to add some depth to the scales. This is a very transparent color so I try to keep it very light. After drying the paint with a hair dryer, I then remove the mesh. You can see the fine scaling pattern. I then use Createx Opaque Black for the back and the eyes. You don't want the paint to come out too heavy when you're doing the back so it doesn't bleed too far down the sides. Since there's no gill plates on this lure, we're going to use a stencil to create them. With opaque black still in the brush, we add the gill plates. To make both sides even, I took some time to eye it up and make a mark with a marker on where the gill plate should start on the other side. With an eye picked out, it's time to super glue the eyes in. I made a spreadsheet with each of the blanks that I use and what eye size and hooks they use. It makes it easy when it's time to put the finishing touches on. With the clear coat tools together, it's time to measure and mix. It's easier to apply the clear coat on a smooth lure, there aren't any nooks and crannies really to deal with, but you still have to make sure that it's very even throughout. The lure will spin for a few hours and then dry the rest of the day. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe.